Hi, I'm Michael with Irwin Power, and I want to help you to make sure that the person you're fixing to hire to do your AC, plumbing, electrical, or general contracting is licensed to do what you're going to pay them to do in the state of Florida. So in Florida, they take unlicensed activity very seriously. You can go to myfloridalicense.com, select verify a license, input the name of the person or business that you're about to pay to do some work, and you will be able to search through a list of licensed and qualified contractors and see the status of their license. Is it active? Is it inactive? Um, or if they're not even on the list, then don't hire them because they're not licensed. So in Florida, it's a third degree felony to do unlicensed work. So as you can see in these photos I'm showing you here, there are people getting arrested left and right in the state of Florida right now who are unlicensed contractors. And uh, oftentimes, you know, it arises because, you know, they're taking somebody's money and then not doing the work. So uh, if you're hiring someone who's licensed and something happens and you want to file a complaint, you can file a complaint um, through this My Florida License website and it'll be investigated. And, uh, you know, if you're hiring unlicensed people, then, I mean, chances are you're not getting a warranty. Chances are they're not going to have insurance that's going to cover any damages that result to your property. Um, and even if they are carrying insurance or claiming to carry insurance, by the time something happens and you need their insurance to fork out some money for something that they did, or since they're not qualified and actually authorized in the state of Florida to do the work you paid them to do, uh, you're not going to have any luck getting money from that insurance company and they're just carrying insurance that... Uh, isn't going to fork over some money for them doing something that they weren't allowed to do in the first place. Uh, insurances do not like to pay out to begin with, so they're going to look into what it is that they're going to have to pay out, and there's going to be a claim you know, made, and they're going to look into that, and you're not going to have the benefit of being covered by that contractor's insurance. So there's many reasons to use licensed people. The people who are licensed have went and taken the exams necessary to prove that they know what they're talking about, that they're qualified to do what they say they can do, and that they have a certain amount of experience in the trade that they're doing. So it's not like they just went and paid for a license and got it in a few weeks. They had to demonstrate to a board that they had the experience requirements laid out by the board of the state. So I hope this video is helpful to you. Um, like I said, go to myfloridalicense.com. It's super simple and you can see if who you're about to hire is licensed or not licensed. I recommend hiring licensed people and not hiring unlicensed people who are going to save you a little bit of money today and possibly cost you a fortune tomorrow.